Hey guys, welcome to Horror and Me. I'm your host, Aaron Mitchell. And on today's video, we're going to be taking a look at my March 2017 Fright Crate. Uh, this just arrived to me on the porch. Um, and I have to be honest, it was really, really difficult not to watch all my YouTube buddies unbox this yesterday. It seems like a bunch of people got theirs yesterday. Um, but that's okay. Um, again, it was just kind of a struggle for the last 24 hours to stay away from YouTube, but I'm super excited that this box is here today. So as always, there's usually some sort of quotes on the sides of the box. So let's read these first. Uh, it says, I've always heard people's criticisms twice as loudly as their praise. And that is a Sam Raimi quote. So very cool. And it looks like on the other side, we have a Toby Hooper quote, and it says, no matter where you're going, uh, it's always the wrong place. Uh, and if you guys are unfamiliar with Toby Hooper, uh, he is a director and he has done films like uh, Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Uh, who else did he do? Or what else did he do? He, I think he did Poltergeist as well. I could be wrong about Poltergeist, but I know he did Texas Chainsaw Massacre. So really cool. Um, I also want to mention you guys might notice that my box might look a little bit different than your guys's that you got this month. Uh, and there's a reason for that. Um, I'm not going to talk about it too much on this video, but in the next few days I will be unveiling something. Uh, Fright Crate and myself have been working on a secret project. And some of the contents are in this box, so I'm going to have to set that aside while I'm doing this unboxing. But I did want to mention that that's why my box might look a little bit different to you guys. So look out in the next few days for an unveiling that I'm super excited about. So let's not waste any more time, guys. <clears throat> let's crack open in this box and see what we got. I'm super excited about this. It seemed like a lot of people, I just saw some messages on Facebook groups and stuff that people were really happy with this box this month. So I'm excited too. Uh, and again, if you guys are interested in subscribing at the end of the video, I will leave the link to Fright Crate in the video description of this video. It is just www.frightcrate.net. So let's not waste any more time and let's get into this. So let me just first pull off the pack on the top and I will set aside my items okay so we got that there all right so wow <laughs> the first thing i'm seeing is pretty awesome what we have here is a jason Voorhees mask looks like a custom mask um so let me just pull this out and this is sweet you can't have enough jason mask i think this makes number five for me so sweet it says camp crystal lake and there's a picture of jason on it so really really cool this doesn't look really look like a lot of the other ones that i have so it, it is uh pretty unique in that way so sweet i hope that's coming out good with the light but very very nice again you can't have too many jason Voorhees masks so cool set that down uh it looks like we have let me see here is this a shirt some sort of shirt let's take a look here Ooh, and this is awesome so this is really, really cool. So I'll show it to you guys first and then we'll talk about it. So what this is, is it's the Pale Man uh, from uh, Pan's Labyrinth with the little girl. Is that the little girl in the front? Yeah. So that's really, really cool. I like that. Again, you don't really see uh, Pan's Labyrinth items or even uh, a lot of things with the Pale Man. Uh, you see some of the stuff with the Fawn, but you don't really see the Pale Man. So that is sweet. I will definitely rock this. Awesome shirt. Cool. So we'll set that down. Uh, what else do we have here? It looks like we have... What is this? Oh, this is cool. I forgot one of the items this month, I believe, was Voodoo for this month. So it looks like we have a little keychain Voodoo doll. I'll try to get it out for you guys, but I'll show it to you first. You guys can see that. I know the light is a little extreme on that. So let me pull it out first, and then we'll take a closer look. So it's called Mini Friends Kung Fu Fighter. Handstand. Maybe this isn't the. Uh, maybe this isn't the Voodoo this month. I can't remember, but what we have here is a Kung Fu Fighter. So nice little. Uh, he almost looks like a little Sam. Uh, trick or treat Sam. So very cool. He's pretty tiny, but cool. We'll set him down. Uh, what else do we have here? Looks like the pin for the month is, oh my gosh, this is awesome. So the pin for the month is a Wishmaster pin, and this is awesome. It is numbered. I have 69 out of 200. So we'll pull it out and we'll take a look at it. This is really cool. Again, another thing that you don't really see. You don't see a lot of uh, Wishmaster. 
So very, very cool. Getting a little bit closer on that. That turned out great. I'm loving these Fright Crate pins. They're very nice. It says make a wish. So sweet. Nice pin. Uh, looks like we have a magnet and this is a, oh, this is awesome. This is a Jason Deluxe magnet. I'll just show it to you guys here in the bag and then we'll take it out and take a closer look. So very, very cool. This is really cool. You don't really see the magnets with like the whole head. You see a lot of them with a mask, but it's nice to have one where you can see like the side of the head too and the neck. Very, very cool. Awesome. That's great. Little magnet on the back. You guys can see. So sweet. That is cool. So we'll set that down. Uh, it looks like we have a Garbage Pail Kid vinyl figure, figure from series one. And I actually only have one in the series. I have Ghastly Ashley. So I'll show this to you guys first, the box. So I have uh, this one here in the middle, Ghastly Ashley right here. Uh, so let's open this up and see who we got. I'd really like Hot Scott. He's like the devil or um, who else do I want? Mad Mike looks cool too. Adam Bomb's cool. So we'll see who we got. All right, I'm not gonna be able to tell in the bag. Let's see. So it looks like we have, and he's got swords and stuff too. I'm gonna have to look in the back and see what his name is. So it looks like we have uh, Mad Mike, so cool. He's like a Amazon man <laughs> type of thing. You guys can see there. So very, very cool. And it looks like he comes with like his ax. You guys can see there and also a sword. So very, very cool. I will put this with my other Garbage Pail Kid. So nice, we'll just do a spin on him. Take a closer peek. So very, very nice. Awesome. That's cool. So we'll set him down. Uh, there's also a Garbage Pail uh, card in here, or is this a sticker? This is a sticker and it says CD Sydney. Let me just pull it out of the little baggie there. So we have CD Sydney there and I'll show you guys the back garbage gang so sweet we'll set that down uh, what is this here oh this is really cool so we have a large garbage pill sticker as well and this is cannibal fat camp um, this is funny okay so let me read the back while we're looking at this so it says dear fright crate customer exclusive to this fright crate is one free copy of the gross and hilarious Cannibal Fat Camp, a splatterpunk satire from the sick minds of Mark C. Cyane and David C. Hayes. And then there's uh, um, links on the back to download that. So that is super cool. That's awesome that they're working with Fright Crate. That's amazing. Awesome. So cool. I'm definitely going to stick this big old sticker on my unboxing table here. So very cool. Awesome. Set that down. Looks like we have some sort of art print here. And this is uh, another print of the Pale Man, and this is cool. And this was done by artist Maritza Luna. So artist Maritza Luna, I'll do a flip on the back and you guys can see uh, her websites and Instagram. So that's very cool. So I'll just show you guys uh, the information for Maritza Luna. If you guys would like to get in contact with her and see more of her art. So cool, very, very nice. I like that. That's sweet. Um, it looks like we might have another art piece. Um, who is this? Ooh, this is awesome. So this is another Jason Voorhees. And this is a nice print. So very cool. I like the style of this one. Very, very cool. And this was done by artist Ray Perello. I'll show you guys the back. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but it uh, looks like some sort of French name. Let me see here. Is it Perello? So that's all uh, his uh, social media sites. So very nice. I like this as well. Very cool. Sweet. So we'll set that down. Uh, what else do we have here? Okay, so this is the spoiler sheet. <clears throat> um, just showcasing what next month is. So it looks like the April's themes will be Reanimator, Child's Play, Nightbreed, They Live, and Texas Chainsaw Massacre. 
So very nice. I'm excited for that. Just let that down. Okay, so that was the box for uh, March 2017 of Fright Crate. So you could have gotten an exclusive Red Dawn custom Jason mask. Jason mask. Uh, we got the exclusive Fawn Labyrinth shirt. Um, or you could have got the Pale Man. <clears throat> or actually, are they all on there? It looks like it's featuring the Fawn, Ophelia, and Pale Man. Okay. <clears throat> I didn't notice that when I was looking at it. Uh, we got a Jason Deluxe Magnet. The Garbage Pail Kids vinyl figure, the Cannibal Fat Camp ebook, which is super cool. That's awesome. Um, the exclusive Make a Wish uh, XL pin from the Wishmaster pin, uh, and then the guest art prints were from Ray Ray per Perillo and Maritza Luna, <clears throat> and it was a Voodoo. Okay, so the Voodoo Friends keychain. It, it was a sword. You kind of got a bunch of different ones. So I'll just show that to you guys here. So very, very cool box. As always, I love Fright Crate. So if you guys are interested in subscribing, uh, just click the link in my video description. And again, it's just www.frightcrate.net. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video and we'll see you guys next time. Hey guys, thanks for watching my video. If you'd like to keep in contact with me and see more of my content, please follow uh, my other social media sites, my Instagram, my Twitter, and my Facebook, uh, where I post a lot of other things that you won't see here on YouTube. Um, and please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. See you guys in the next video.